I just updated my uh, Chromium Daily um, web browser again, and this time is a different problem. Okay, so last time we uh, rolled back our Flash, but this time uh, it's actually with Chromium itself. Now, this is gonna warn you about you know this Flash plugin is out of date, uh, which I know is out of date because I rolled back myself. Now this is actually a security feature, so I don't want to fault them for it, but um, you know you want to use the old one then you would have to disable this warning and that's what we're gonna do now if your flash is working then don't do this you know uh, update you know to the newer flash that's what you're supposed to do but for me the newer flash does not work and I'm gonna have to disable this message uh, for the time being uh, so to do this uh, as you can see that you know my flash ain't work I mean you can run it but you have to click this every time you watch a you know a, a flash video or something so what you have to do is just add this uh, um, to your, your launcher. Okay. So if you're on GNOME or KDE, um, pretty much you go to the menus. Let me go edit applications here. And you're gonna add this line in there uh, into your launcher. So just navigate to the Chromium, um, you know, shortcut. And let me zoom in on here so you can see. But basically, what you have to do is add this at the end of the Chromium, okay? Uh, dash dash allow dash outdated plugins, and this will allow you to run uh, the old plugins without them warning you, okay? That's all you gotta do, and then you know, um, save it, or whatever. Uh, so I did that already. Let's close it now. If I uh, use that um, thing here, the launcher here. It's not going to warn me about that crap anymore. Right? There you go. Everything is fine now. I have the flash working. Uh, so that's how you would disable um, the out of date uh, plugin warning for Chromium or I think even Chrome. Um, so that's it. If you have that problem and you still want to use the old version, because the newer flash doesn't work. Now, don't do that if you know all your plugins do work, okay? Because it's a security feature and it's supposed to be there. So, that's it for this one.